Hello YouTube. So today I want to do a hair care video and little Lupin wants to get in the picture. Such a good boy. Okay, so yes, I'm going to start off by telling you that my hair is wet. I did get out of the shower. Well, I did. Um, about, you know, 20 minutes ago. And so I decided, okay, I'm going to do a hair care video. Awesome. Okay, so first off, we're going to start off with shampoo and conditioner. I use two different shampoos and conditioners because I take, I wash, I take, I wash my hair every other day and every other shampoo I like to switch it just so my hair doesn't get used to it and so because my shampoo and conditioners do not do the same thing, they do two different things. So I try to keep my hair balanced. First thing I use is um, this Joyco K-Pack Reconstruct. <laughs> shampoo and conditioner looks like this comes in the little brown bottles um i got these at ulta along with the k-pack reconstruct deep deep penetrating reconstructure for damaged hair these came in a bag for 24.99 at ulta um they smell super amazing um these kind of smell like bananas just a slight bit and they smell a whole lot like bananas this says only it says leave on for five minutes using it for more than five minutes is nothing more than what it would do for five minutes so leave it on for five minutes like shave or i don't know do whatever it is that you else need to do in the shower and then rinse this out um i really like this it's really really helped repair my hair from all the color and heat damage i've done to it um to the point where now my hair gets like oily so i really really like it i probably i will be repurchasing the joy coat line i'm not for sure what i want to use next but i still got probably a, a month left on these bottles but I don't know for sure yet. And the other ones that I use is this John Frieda Brilliant Brunette Multi-Tone Revealing Daily Shampoo and Moisturizing Conditioner. I got these at Walmart for, I think about $5 each. Um, they are non-color depositing and I don't really know how like they make your hair more multi-tone-ish. I really don't. Um, they do the moisturizing one says softness and shine in one use which it does make my hair <laughs> more soft and manageable and i wouldn't necessarily say shiny but it's very soft and it's very manageable and it smells really good like i really like these will i be repurchasing them i don't know <laughs> i like to buy different things each time so my hair doesn't get used to it so it can get the full um benefits from each product Okay, next up, we are going to say, when you get out of the shower, if the first thing you reach for to do your hair is a hairbrush, you are wrong. You are wrong, so wrong. You've done so much damage to your hair. You have so many breakage. This causes like split ends and breakage, and this is just very, very bad for your hair whenever your hair is wet. What I recommend, and the pros, because I did go to cosmetology school, Cause, you know same thing for a little while and then um, it was gonna cost $41,000 so I dropped what I do recommend instead of using a brush is a wide tooth comb this will prevent the breakage or pulling or split ends you just start from the bottom and you work your way up slowly but and this with this being one row it'll take the knot piece by piece and pull it apart and not pull it out of your hair with this with this having I don't know 10 rows maybe I'm not counting this will yank the knot out there for breaking the hair so I highly recommend this this came in this Mariana 10 piece professional styling kit that I got um, in my cause kit so I don't I'm sure you can pick this up at like Sally's or Ulta or wherever you know you buy your stuff i don't think walmart has this though but i did get this at the mcx for like four dollars it's just the regular brush conair brush with um like the gel grippy i really like this like i really like how it fits in my hand how it feels in my hand so i can sit there and do my thing only when my hair is dry huh. i cannot reiterate that enough like do not do that damage to your hair 
it is so bad for you like if you want to do that damage why don't you just go ahead and bleach your hair and not rinse it out like just leave it in there for like an hour and a half that's just so so bad oh my god and bleach is horrible learn that the right way next things that i use are the products i use the tresemme nourishing rituals cashmere touch hydrating serum every single time i wash my hair this makes my hair super soft super manageable super um moisturized i like it it will conceal like breakage and split ends um for that you know that temporary amount of time no matter what a product says you know no how no matter how great it's like oh well, i promise you you will not have split ends that is a lie because all it does is temporarily mend it until next time the only way to actually get rid of your split ends is to get it off or to get to to cut it off i'm having a day today i got this at walmart for like five or six dollars i definitely will be repurchasing this again this is awesome this is this is so good for my hair and doesn't cause a lot of buildup. Um, I never had a buildup product, buildup problem. Um, so I, oh my gosh, I'm shedding. So yeah, like I really, really like this and it smells good. Um, it comes in 3.3 .3 fluid ounces, so I don't think you can travel with this. But this is absolutely, absolutely amazing. I cannot say enough good things about this. Okay. My second one is the one that I used in my hair straightening video. It's the FX Brazilian Smooth 7 Day Smoothing Spray. Um, I really like it. I have to wash my hair every other day. So if I'm going to straighten my hair every other day, I use this every other day. It says it will keep your hair straight for 7 days, but I can't test that out because I cannot go a week without washing my hair whatsoever. Um, it does a really good job with the humidity. Um, you know, I live near the beach, so it's humid all the time. Um, it really does what it says. It keeps your curls and stuff under control and it's just a really good product. I got this at Walmart for like four or five dollars, maybe six, but I highly doubt it was six. Um, and the last product I have is the Got To Be Crazy Sleek Extra Large Conditioning Flat Iron and Blow Dry Lotion. Looks like this. It's in the orange pyramid. I got this at Walgreens for about $9. I'm not 100%, but I got, like I said, like you, I think you can pick this up at Walmart too. Um, this comes, does not come out in a mist. It says, you know, spray on tile dried hair, distribute evenly. You cannot um spray this directly on your hair if unless you want like a stream of like goopy texture i have to spray this in the palm of my hands like two to four times depending on like the level of straightness i want and then i rub it together and i evenly distribute it and then i run through it with a rat tail comb to make sure all the products distributed and then i blow dry it and then i use this again um before i flat iron if i want super straight hair I don't really know if it says works with the heat of your blow dry and flat iron. So, um, but the directions just say blow dry completely then flat iron. So I don't really know if you're supposed to use this before you flat iron, but I do and it keeps my hair straight and it's moisturizing and it doesn't damage. This you only use whenever you're flat ironing. Do not use this before you blow dry. Um, why? I don't know. I just, just something about this says do not use this before I blow dry. Only use it whenever you flat iron. I don't know. If you want to do it, I don't know. Let me know how it goes, but I'm not held responsible. The last two things in my video are my heat um, tools. I do not have my Marcel iron on me. It's in the bedroom and I don't feel like going and finding it. Like I said, this is my one inch Remington flat iron. Um, it has, I think, steel plates. I got this at Walmart for 20 bucks. Like I said, I really, really like this. It does its job, holds up better than the things you can buy at Sally's. And it, um, it is good for curling your hair also. I haven't mentioned that yet. But I really, really, really like this. Like I said, it's only $20 at Walmart, so it's pretty cheap. And it works as well as stuff at Sally's. So, you know, save, you know, some money. And my last and final thing is my hair dryer. It is the Ceramic Extreme by Babless Pro. 
looks like this. I got this in my cause kit. I don't know if you can actually buy this in the US. I think my cause instructor said this is a uh, European based. This is like the world's coolest hair dryer. It has, you know, your um, concentrator and then I went out and I bought a diffuser, but those are in the closet. And I don't feel like I'm gonna looking for them. It has three heat settings, cool, warm, and hot. And it has your cool shot. This blow dries your hair super, super fast. So it's least, it's least, it's less amount of heat on your hair, um, time wise. It's, if you right now go and take your blow dryer and you put it on high, it is like this on low. It's super efficient, super fast. It's, you know, it's kind of lightweight. It's not heavy, but it's not like the world's lightest hair dryer. Um, I actually think this is pretty expensive and I think you can probably buy this online. But if you can find something like this, I highly recommend it. Um, yeah, like I can do a, um, a blowout in about 20 minutes with this on a slow day. Like on a fast day, I can do it in about seven. This thing works awesomely, awesomely well. I love it. Um, although I don't really use it that much just because I don't like putting that much heat on my hair. But whenever I do use it, it's like the world's greatest. But yes, that is all I have for you guys today. Um, I do want to say that if you guys have been sending me inboxes, it will not let me load it for some reason. I don't know if it's YouTube or my internet. Chances are it's probably my internet. And yes, I hope you guys like this video, learned some things, and if you guys have any hair care tips that you know you want to share with me or anybody else, leave them down below and I will be sure to read them. But yes, I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.